So some of you are probably looking at this screen right now wondering, what? Did Mike get Madden? What's going on here? Well, let me explain that to you guys in one second. This channel supports Extra Life in its efforts to raise money for the Children's Miracle Network. For more information about how to donate and join in their efforts, go to the link displayed here. Extra Life. Play games. Hill Kids. What up everybody, this is your boy Black Magus, and yes, this is Madden NFL 16. Um, I think that's what they call it now. Madden NFL 16 or Madden 16, whatever you want to call it. Anyway. Why am I showing Madden footage on my channel? Quite simple, to be quite honest. And that's because over this past weekend, um, EA sent me an email and told me that they'll be allowing a free trial weekend of Madden. And, you know, I was like, you know what, let me try it out. Because even if it's something that I'm not particularly big on, that I don't care for, or that I just flat out um, don't like... I'm willing to give just about any damn thing a chance and, you know, give a fair and honest opinion of it because I think it's important that we go out and, you know, try new things and not just keep ourselves within a bubble. And, you know, Madden being the only football game, it is that um, franchise that if you're a football fan but you don't like this game that you probably owe it to yourself to at least give the new iteration a shot to see if you might want to I guess jump back on board with what they're doing now um as far as Madden 16 goes and I'm sure you guys just second quarter action because this is pretty much where the majority of the action happened in particular for me and yes I'm using my Redskins yes I'm using RG3 um, and hey, look, Andre Robinson is even in the game. And I used Alf Morris. I was doing it all. I was using all of the key components of the Redskins um, roster this game. Ain't that wild? You know, the people who were around when the Redskins were actually pretty damn decent. Um, anyway, I need to stop taking shots at Jay Gruden and his fucking um, coaching. Seriously, I really need to not... Um, harp on that shit too much but fuck Jay Gruden anyway so what do I think of Madden 16 um it's pretty cool I cannot lie I mean and I come into Madden every year with questions um the last Madden I bought now is actually 15 and just as a caveat to that I only bought it because it only cost me a dollar and 25 cents it was on the Black Friday or um a like early like month sale at Amazon that I caught and I had some credit and the credit ended up like bringing it from like I think it was on sale for 20 and then I had like $19 in credit or something like that it up cost me like a dollar and a quarter something like ridiculous um I, I, I always remember it was like a dollar and some change it was it wasn't more than a dollar fifty it was probably closer to a dollar and a quarter which insane insane but worth it to me because I got to try out the game for less than what I was willing to pay for um, and I was glad that EA gave me this trial because I got to try a game that I wasn't particularly looking to get for less than I'm willing to pay for so I guess for two straight years it worked out well for me now going back to what I was saying games actually pretty cool um, I, I can't sit here and say that um, my initial experience wasn't cool I didn't get a chance to play it as much as I could I'm only got like a few hours in but from what I was able to play, um, there were some things that I really, really liked. Like, I actually do like the way that they handle passing a little bit better. Where they, you know, emphasize you using the direct, using the um, buttons to dictate how you threw the ball. I thought that was done a little better than like necessarily having particular like pressure applied to. Um, the throwing button, mind you, that's still there. But I like how you know you hold, I believe it was hold L two to throw it high, so that the receiver will have to go up and try to catch it at the highest point. Or you use L one to throw it towards the ground. 
You know, I thought that um, made more sense. Um, I believe in previous years they actually tried to use a stick for that, which I didn't think worked that well. Um, I like the way that they organized this better. Um, the catching after the pass is up, um, it's an interesting thing. It's not something I'm huge on um, in particular because I do uh, see what people have said. Like, particularly right there on that catch when I hit the button, I actually followed the prompt and did the aggressive catch because the throw was a little off and if I didn't do the aggressive catch probably was a guarantee that that was going to get intercepted but holding down that aggressive catch button he did like a spectacular catch um to get that ball but that's what they do when they do the aggressive catch and um there's a counter to it on defense and I do believe that that is also a little bit too much because while you can do the aggressive catch on offense, they can do like an aggressive go for the ball. And it, they can kind of counter things. There was many times in my playthroughs of this game where I would throw good passes. And it would go right into the receiver's hand. And then the defender would just make this spectacular punch to knock the ball out. Or you know things like that. It was just like, really? Like, that don't happen as often as it's... Sh- sh- it, does in this game in real life so um there are still the like things like that that would kind of make me groan and like really y'all doing a little too much on this you know you get the overkill with some of the spectacular moments um and things like that um suctioning is still kind of there i've noticed that on some running plays where morris would just suction to the defender so there's that legacy issue um it didn't seem that overbearing um but i noticed it from here and here you know every now and then um you know but the camera was kind of interesting because i don't remember the camera being that close but i was able to adjust to it i didn't change any cameras to classic it, it, it was okay after i adjusted from what i was used to um you know but it's it's pretty solid i can't sit here and bash too much. I mean, is it something that I'm going to get? Probably not, because I'd probably do it like I did last year. Last year's I didn't think was that bad, yet I barely played it because I, you know, maybe it's just my personal, um, dis, you know, distaste for the way that EA has done this series over the years. That's keeping me from, like, jumping all the way in, but, um, you know, I can't sit here and dog the game. Uh, it, it's it's actually pretty solid. I, I can't lie. Um, I'm sure if I spent more time, I'd be able to dig out more issues. As, you know, I have to say, as much as I talk bad about this, I do understand from having my frustrations with NBA 2K over the years and having dropped that, that um, it is kind of a thing about sports games where you will continually have these crazy legacy issues that will arise up or just things that they just can't totally get right um i do think that they should still push and try to get as you know close to perfection as possible because i think that's one of the things i've always um felt was holding madden back you know the fact that they are the only thing in town they got lazy and they didn't really feel like they need to work hard because who else is out there to take them down you know what i mean Um, but I do think that if they continue to work, like, I think they're heading in a better direction than they have been since I stopped. I stopped playing Madden. God damn. Oh, man. Like, regularly I stopped playing it about 10 years ago. I finally said I'm not sucking another one after the 2008 one. Of course, I kind of lied to myself because I think I ended up getting... 2012 or 13 for free and of course I got 2015 for like a dollar and a quarter um, but I never really played them because well I can say with 12 or 13 whichever one had Marshall Falk on the cover it was just dissatisfying um, with 15 I just didn't have room on my plate and you know I, I guess I was just 13 kind of was the nail in the coffin for my strong interest in Madden, I honestly would like to see another game come up to give it some competition. So I think that we'll get the better version of Madden, the best that they've ever done in a while. 
once they have someone to scare the hell out of them and come out with a solid game for them to contend against. Um, but at the same time, I can't sit here and tell you guys that this is a bad product. It's not a bad product. It's actually a pretty solid um, product for Madden. I mean, and again, I, it could be that I don't play it as regularly as most people and that I didn't spend as much time to see all the problems. I'm not going to sit here and say I'm an expert, but I can just tell you guys from like what I played, it, it was cool. It was cool. Um, just wish I would have had more time over the weekend to spend with it, just to dig into it a little bit more and to see what was what um, with the game. But, you um, know, hey, um, I think it's 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 worth the, it's worth giving a try. Definitely. Um, hopefully they give another demo or trial so you guys can try it. Apologies for not getting to you early enough to let you guys know about this. Cause I think that would have been a really good thing for like a lot of people who have been skeptical on Madden to be able to go ahead and give this a shot because they let you play everything in a trial. You had access to all of the components, ultimate team. Um, draft champs, the online stuff I never got a chance because I didn't get to try it until the last day late at night and I was like okay let me play what I can and not waste too much time just to see what mechanically is going on with the game which has always been my biggest um, issue with Madden anyway um, but you know if they do another trial I'll try to like throw that out on Twitter as soon as possible I think I did tweet it out the day it was but hopefully some of you got to see that and I'll do that again if they do this again but yeah um it it's not it's not a bad game definitely not a bad game they're they're getting there they're trying to get there and that's what I appreciate at least the effort is kind of showing at this point to me um but anyway you guys hit me up let me know what you think and I'll haunt you later this your boy black Megas and I'm out deuces